Colorox specializes in the import of grain products and of animal feed products. It is in charge of the entire grain import chain logistics, from price negotiations up until delivery to the end customer. Based in Geoff Lasfa, this subsidiary of the Halmarkam Group aspires to become the leader in its industry. To achieve its objective, it draws on a reliable model centered on a trading business unit based in Geneva, acting as an international hub. The import by ships directly from North America and South America, Brazil and Argentina. And finally, a logistics base in the port of Joflasfa, making it possible to maintain a stock under bond to supply the feed manufacturers. Thanks to its global outreach, Yellow Rock offers manufacturers integrated and proven solutions. It all begins by the trading operations. Each day, specialists perform market trend analysis and inform customers about the best purchase and supply opportunities. Purchases are made directly from producers in North and South America. The transport of products to Morocco is made by sea. As a result of the deep draft at Joff Lasfa port, Yellow Rock can charter high-capacity vessels of the Panamax type, thereby carrying up to 60,000 tons of products by trip. On the other hand, this makes it possible to optimize the cost of transport, thus achieving economies of scale, and on the other hand, to reduce its carbon footprint. Once the ship is moored, another work is about to start, the unloading. Here, the machines take the control. Thanks to the grain terminal of Mass Céréales Al Maghreb, another subsidiary of the Holmarkham Group, Yellow Rock enjoys cutting-edge logistics facilities for the handling of grains. The facilities offer an unloading rate of 800 tons per hour. Yellow Rock has the storage capacity of 120,000 tons of cereals in the Joff Larsva port. With this permanent level of stock, our customers are assured of the availability of products throughout the year. But there's yet another advantage. The products are in bonded storage. Customers are hence free to clear the goods and pay them as and when they need them. Goes without saying that this improves significantly their cash flow position. Widening even more is service offer. Yellow Rock provides direct delivery to the end customer. Yellow Rock's offering brings real value to our customers in terms of support and guidance. It is permanently connected to commodity markets, the main one being the Chicago Board of Trade. Thanks to a web platform dedicated to the supply of raw materials, our customers get an analysis of the market trends and are constantly updated on the best buying opportunities on a real-time basis. In order to ensure a high level of transparency and quality, Yellow Rock ensures full traceability of the goods ordered. A test laboratory controls permanently the quality of raw materials, starting from the receipt of the products all through the storage period. By retaining effective control of the entire logistics chain, the company constantly offers its customers high service quality and ongoing support. With an annual target of 1 to 1.2 million tons of imported animal feed products, Yellow Rock is keen to contribute to the growth of this industry in Morocco. Thanks to its countless assets and to its geographical and cultural proximity with Africa, Yellow Rock aspires to become an international integrated distribution platform in most Western African ports. rises, bringing the promise that all dreams are still possible. Every morning, the Oriental region is the first part of Morocco to be touched by the sun's rays. 
It is here that Olmacom Group was born, founded on solid values that are transmitted from generation to generation. After attaining independence, a country must be built and a new economy established to serve national development. Abdelkader Ben Salah had the skills and personality necessary to meet such challenges. From his family's homeland, in the Oriental region, this committed and visionary man patiently built a business empire that today is active in numerous business sectors. Finance, agro-industry, distribution and logistics, real estate and air transport. From its beginning, the group aimed to promote Morocco's vast potential. It acquired Les Eaux Minérales d'Ulmez and transformed it into a modern and prosperous company. Production was diversified with the launch of Sidi Ali, Morocco's most popular mineral water, and of Ain Atlas. The group also displayed its North African and Mediterranean roots through the creation of Les huiles d'olive de la Méditerranée. Isnasa is an extra virgin olive oil with the finesse and characteristics that symbolize its terroir. Olmacom is organized around its core businesses, which still compose the group's foundation. Comptoir Métallurgique Marocaine, which led to Comptoir de l'Industrie and Comptoir de l'Electroménager, is the flagship of the distribution and logistics segment. It diversified its business with the launch of the Atlas Furnishings brand. The finance segment is built around the Atlanta Insurance Company. This segment has grown with the addition of a second insurance company, Sanad while Atlanta has opened its capital to investors through an IPO on the Casablanca Stock Exchange. Olmacom has combined its resources to modernize and develop its business activities. This momentum was further consolidated with the arrival of the group's new chairman, Mohamed Hassan Ben Salah, who took over in 1993. The group is active in the privatization process and has acquired the Office National du Thé et du Sucre, renamed Somates. The group has expanded its scope of activity by creating Mass Céréales El Maghreb, which operates two terminal concessions for grain handling and storage at the Jof Lasfa and Casablanca ports. Olmacom has decided to enhance its logistics operations with the creation of Yellow Rock in the Jof Lasfa port. This company is specialized in logistics services related to the import of grain products for the animal feed industry, from price negotiation to final delivery. The group is not afraid to take on new business challenges and has pioneered Moroccan skies with the creation of regional airlines. In addition, the group has strengthened its position in the air transport sector with the launch of the Air Arabia Maroc low-cost carrier. Olmacom also invests in the media sector and holds a controlling interest in Radio Plus. Olmacom Group has always made social and solidarity action a priority. The Abdelkader Ben Salah Foundation supports charitable associations and works with key organizations for social and human development in Morocco. Paul Marcom Group thus continues to lead the way, proudly bearing its economic and social responsibilities, faithful to its past and open to the future.